Hey guys, Kobe here. Just thought I'd do a bit of a rundown on my backyard camp oven cooking. Uh, yeah, so hope you enjoy it. See, see how we go. So here's my backyard setup. Uh, it's got a bit of a pit there. Well, it's not really a fire pit. We had to have it flat because backyard got to use the backyard. So we got trailers and stuff here. So got to be able to drive over it. So uh, this will be. This is one of the I'm going to get a Bunning or an Aldi, El Cheapo, but uh, we'll do the fire in there for the coals. Then uh, this is a little damper tray we use, so we'll just put a couple of coals in there and do the damper in there. And then uh, here's the, uh, that's where we'll uh, do the food, do the uh, camp oven feed, and uh, that'll be coming up later. So this is the new camp oven we bought today, we're going to give this a crack. This is the uh, Austral 9 quart. Uh, you'd be a Chinese job more than likely, but it's uh, pretty well the only one we could buy. Their uh, shops are pretty empty of them at the moment. Everyone must have been getting into camping with this COVID crap around. So we'll season that up and throw some tucker in it. First step, make sure you give your camp oven a good wash, hot soapy water. Get all the china dust off. So into the oven. Uh, after we've had a good rinse off, that'll get it a little bit warm. Uh, we got the oven on pretty hot. Flat Bicky. So while the uh, camp oven's heating up, we'll um, pick a few bits and pieces from our lovely little garden. Out of the oven and time to lube up. Get some cooking oil, canola, whatever you've got and give it a good rub all inside. Don't forget the lid. Got a nice shine on the whole lot. Beautiful. Back into the oven for a good 30 to 40 minutes. You want to get that nice and hot now. This is the jungle juice fire starter. Bit of the old metho on there. Don't go crazy. Ready for that. Instant flame. <laughs> and that's how we start fire. Easy man's way. Fire! Me, man, I have created fire. Ooh, fire. Ooh, ooh, ooh. <laughs> Jeez. Well, there goes my seat. Jump in my grave, why don't you? Looking forward to tea? Oh, yeah, absolutely. Saturday night. Saturday night. Beer. Living, fire. Living the dream. Camp oven. <laughs> living the dream. Living the dream. Food prep as easy as of the fingers. Now this is how a pro preps.
too many. So there she is. Uh, that'll sit now for probably around about an hour, uh, 45 minutes to an hour, and we'll recoal it with some fresh coals. Right, okay, so time to have a look. It's been one hour, and we're just going to have a bit of a sticky. So if we can get this lid off that appears to be stuck, why I don't know. There we go. How's that looking? Pretty bloody good. So we'll give that a bit of a stir. Oh, she's watery. Might have to uh, thin that, thicken that up a bit. Still got a bit to go yet. Another hour, hour and a half possibly. She's plenty hot in there though. Right. Second lot of coals going in. Progressing nicely, should be uh, about an hour away, I reckon. And we're gonna do a cheesy damper, so hopefully, that'll uh, come out good and we don't burn it because we've had a few beers. Woohoo! Cheesy damper time. Uh, if you'd like the recipes, they're all in the description. damper I only put half a shovel on the bottom that basically stops it burning I will put more on top probably a couple of shovels to help it brown That's what you want. There we go, that bad boy. Oh, look at that bad boy. That's what you want. That's what I'm talking about, baby. Yes. Yes. That is coming along lovely now. Just about there. Look at that sensation. Mate, if that doesn't get your world Rockin', I don't know what will. Well, what a feed. Hey, how good was that? Delicious. Have a look at this. Tasted as good as the one it smelled. Empty plates. Cheers. Cheers. Hey guys, if you enjoyed the video, give us a like. Uh, also, if you want to see other rubbish I put up, hit the subscribe button, because apparently that's what you do on YouTube. 
Hey, yay.